What's up everyone? Just uh, <clears throat> been wanting to do a video for the last two weeks, actually three weeks, and uh, haven't had time. Um, anyways, uh, just want to say uh, a big thank you to everyone that's finished their big rig uh, build. Um, there's some sweet looking trucks out there. Everyone's doing an awesome job. Um, if you're not done with it, keep going, uh, because I am nowhere near being done myself. Uh, I hope to have a uh, update on my truck shortly. I don't know if I'll get it today. It'll probably be this week. I don't know. I've been working 75-plus uh, hours a week. I had an 86-hour a week last week in five days, so when I come home Friday night, I don't have work on Saturday. I usually sleep all day, so... Uh, I did have, uh, I did have a stash update to do, uh, that's what part of this video is going to be, and, uh, a mail call, got a couple shop cards in, uh, as you can see in front of you here, uh, I got Vince, uh, Weston's, uh, card in, um, got this a few weeks ago. Uh, just like I said, I've been busy, haven't had much time to do a video, so, and that's uh, pretty cool. He's got Vern there on his perch uh, in the card. That's uh, that's one cool card, Vince, so I appreciate it for you uh, sending it to me. I know you got my card. Uh, I've seen your mail call video. Um, anyways, uh, I appreciate it. If you're not subbed to his channel, uh, Vincent Weston. Um, go check them out. Awesome builder. Um, and then I also got this card. Uh, I helped Steve. <clears throat> Steve procrastinates like me. Uh, I knew just by the way his uh, work schedule is and everything that uh, he probably would have never got the cards made if it was up to him. So I took, uh, I gave him a little hand on the card. Uh, he showed me what he wanted. And I, uh, I did it for him, and then I sent them to him, too, so, uh, because I had the feeling that if I sent him the picture of the finished product, that he'd take forever to, uh, to get it printed, so, there you go. You know, Steve, it's, uh, it's the least I could do, uh, I'm glad you liked the card, I think they turned out sweet, and, uh, you know. You're, you're welcome. Your your kind words and everything, your thank yous are, are appreciated. Um, but I know uh, your work schedule is a lot like mine. I'm uh, doing 17 hours sometimes a day, and that's uh, way too much. Plus, I'm running, after I do my normal uh, driving duties, I'm in a machine for the rest of the day. Either loading trucks or breaking up concrete or whatever it is. So... Um, but you're uh, welcome. If you're not uh, sub to Big Steve, check him out also. Uh, also, uh, got some milk. Uh, got some. Uh, got some stash updates. Uh, um, the Ming uh, ship that I built for the 48-hour build. Uh, that was one of the kits I got at Hobby Lobby on sale. I, I actually bought two of them. They were six bucks. Uh, so I got two of them. I built one for the 48 hour build. I got uh, this from uh, an auction off of Facebook. And uh, it's sealed. I think I paid uh, 12 for it plus shipping. So, and it's sealed. So, that's good. Uh, let's see what else I uh, get here. I got, uh, oh. I don't know if I posted this or not. My wife uh, owed me. Uh, she said she owed me a Christmas or a birthday present, so I never uh, 
I'll never turn on a birthday or a Father's Day present. So she got me the polyglass gas or two. I've uh, been looking for this one. Been wanting this one for a while. So got that one. Oh, she's so good to me. Anyways, uh, I'll probably be moving to uh, moving to Florida. Go live on Thomas's couch because uh, I bought a couple more things this weekend that she didn't find out yet about. Uh, also, I got the uh, 37 Ford uh, Ford convertible custom. 1937 this was on sale for 749 uh, one of the reduced kits at Hobby Lobby I checked two of the three nearby Hobby Lobbies <clears throat> and uh, the two ship kits and them two kits uh, the uh, the uh, 37 Ford were the only two that I found um, on sale tried finding the uh, the airbrush that was reduced that wasn't there um, and I have, uh, a couple more that I traded, uh, Big Eddie for, and Big Eddie, I'm sorry man, I did not get your kid in the mail, I know you said don't worry about it, when I get it, I get it, but I feel bad, I haven't had time, uh, I will try this week, it's supposed to rain a couple days, so I'm hoping that, uh, I get an de extra day off, but so far that hasn't happened, uh, we traded a kit for uh, these. He gave me the Corsair F4U4-4 um, and the Dauntless. I got them two from him. Also, he had a Arizona kit. So, I got an Arizona kit. Built one of these a long time ago. I think it was a bigger scale, too. Um... I definitely want to get back into shipbuilding. Uh, let's see, what else? Oh, and then uh, a buddy of mine happened to go to a, last last weekend, he went to a uh, a uh, estate sale in Chicago and uh, texted me these pictures. Uh, this was 12 bucks. He got it for 8 They They took 8 for it, so got 8 bucks for that. It was sealed, of course. I'm like a kid and I opened it. Uh, and then I got two vets. I'll just put them together both. Uh, these were six bucks a piece. And the lady has, that did not sell, the lady has a Heritage, I think it's the Heritage uh, Classic. Or uh, she's, got a, she's got a bag or a Harley Davidson kit that was 120 <clears throat> at the uh sale and uh it did not sell so she has a consignment store nearby next town over so i tried to get there saturday but i didn't make it sunday today they were closed so i have both of these kits both are sealed uh for six bucks a piece so um some nice additions i haven't done a vet in a long time i'm not really a vet guy but I do like the uh, 63, 65, 67 area, era vets. So we'll definitely put them in the stash and do something with them. Uh, back on the uh, Big Rig group build, I want to thank you and Thomas. Uh, me and Thomas both want to thank everyone that joined. Um, I think we ended up with 110 total builders or entries into the uh, group build uh, that's awesome I mean for the first time uh, I'm very impressed and we are going to do it next year I should have all the info up on that next year's group build uh, by the end of the month or the middle of uh, September so we'll We'll go ahead and post that up by then, and it will start January 1st. Um, and then the rest of the rules, or the rest of the info will be in that video. So, awesome builds. Um, I'm trying to catch up on videos. I'm like 120 I have to watch. I'm just kind of zipping through them. I'm not commenting on all of them, but I am giving you guys a thumbs up. So, I'm like four weeks three and a half four weeks behind on videos i'm watching videos from uh 
July still, so I am trying to catch up. Trying to catch up on that, so. Uh, see, that's 10 minutes almost of me babbling, so uh, just want to thank everyone for joining the group build. And uh, we will definitely be hosting it next year again. And uh, I'm watching videos, even though I don't, if I normally comment on your video and I didn't, I'm, I'm just trying to catch up. So it's been a crazy last month and a half been really busy at work so I was supposed to take a vacation and we ended up having somebody quit and then we had one of our operators that run machines get us, uh, broke his leg so uh, I've been doing double duty so um, and I'm the only one that could haul the, the heavy machinery nobody else nobody else has the experience with it I got a we just hired a new guy, and we're gonna. I'm gonna train him, so uh, that'll take some of the slack off. Cause two o'clock in the morning, uh, going to work sucks. Um, the money's nice, but yeah, I need a break. So, all right, guys, be good. Have a good week, and uh, we'll talk to everyone later. I'm out.